when I describe a food, I use the N word. <laughs> Welcome back to Food Finders. I am newly married. Yay! This episode, we're gonna bring you to a whole bunch of different unique buffets. And we chose Joy because she looks like she can eat a lot. I wore also a very big shirt today and very open pants. So now that you reveal okay. that you're married, yes. all the girls who are watching the videos for you will not watch again. Eh? Uh, Apparently for today's video, the producers have given us each yep. three words that we're not supposed to say, but we don't know what the words are. And whoever says those mystery words yep. the most will get a penalty at the end. I find buffets, like, as you get older, it's not as worth it anymore because like, you can't eat as much. We're trying to keep our stomachs open for what's to come today. You have to be very strategic when you eat buffets now. No older. carbs. Yeah, no carbs, man. <laughs> Let's go to our first buffet spot. Why are you laughing? You just burp! Let's go to our first buffet spot right now. <laughs> we are at El Jesra restaurant where they serve all you can eat prata. Wow, this is bananas! We're here at this 24-hour restaurant. They have 16 varieties of prata that you can choose from. Oh wow, no they sharing. have the honey prata as well. Right. Pineapple honey. prata, wow. The irony is we literally just said that you shouldn't eat cups at a buffet, yeah. but guess and what we're doing? this is the doing. first place that we're going to today. <laughs> Okay, we got a strawberry. We got cheese. Cheese, banana, strawberry. What was the last And masala. Masala, okay. Try the banana. You wanna gra grab some. She kind of looks like potato. Is man. this masala? Yo, this is not. <laughs> this is not banana. This is masala, I think. Dip it in the curry, it's good. This is like a curry puff, but like in a prata. It's quite interesting. I think this is cheese then. This looks maybe like maybe this, this is, is banana. banana. Okay, this is definitely cheese. Cheese. Okay, we're gonna try cheese. If you can eat more than like four pratas and above, you'd be good for the buffet. But if you want like really good value, right? Eat the most expensive prata. Cheese and mushroom is three fifty on the a la carte. Oh my god, you're so Asian. So this has to be banana, right? This definitely has to be banana. Okay, see the oh, banana. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's yeah, the banana. Yeah, okay, that's the banana. Yes. Actually, the banana prata is pretty good. How do you kind of work? One of my friends, he eats like prata with sugar. I didn't know that was a thing. Yeah. I feel like that's diabetes. Now I actually like to eat it with both like sugar and curry. Are like you team sugar, team curry, or team sugar and curry? So this is a strawberry one. Right. It looks like it's made with strawberry jam. It Imagine. tastes like that Asian tube cracker thing oh, like snack. The, is it the wafer? No. The wafer one. It's like an artificial strawberry flavor. But I prefer the banana one. For seven ninety, it's crazy though. Which one's your favorite? I typically like cheese. But I would say like the masala potato thing is, is, a, is a real winner. A game changer. Yeah. A game yeah, changer. Yeah, yeah. Wait, but we should chill out because literally we're starting out with full carbs and we still have like oh. three more places to go. So I don't think it's a good idea. Come with your friends. I think this is like a really unique prata buffet. I think it's a really cool concept because it's open 24 hours. You can come here for supper yep. and just like eat your heart out for all the pratas. And that's it for El Jazra. We're gonna move off to the next buffet place. Oh. Uh, well, it only starts like what? Three onwards? Or something? Three? Four? Oh my god, stop okay. picking your ear set. Sorry. It's all on I'm camera. Sorry. We're not gonna use this. Do you think I'm stupid? We're, we're here <laughs> at the first Halal Soda 5 Taiwan inspired hot plate restaurant. You order a hot plate, then it comes with free flow bubble tea. I'm quite excited about the free flow bubble tea because I drink like three times a week. That's diabetes. Let's go! Do you say the name of the Oh yeah, place? oh my god, I forgot the name. Three, two, one, action. We're at Wong Fu Fu. What are you holding? This is the semi buffet that is available when you order hot one plate. hot plate. Oh my god. You get your milk tea or your iced lemon tea and then mm. your pearls are here. Oh wow, look at that. Okay, so you, you can add your own sugar. Don't cover the pearls. Double 
food well, is here. You can customize each hot plate with a meat selection of your choice, the carb, and then every plate will come with an egg. We got the fried chicken, we got the fried rice, and the strip loin steak. This one's with pasta, and then we have the seafood with udon. There is a super amazing lunch promo going on. Yeah. It's just $16.90 from 11.30 to 5 p.m. on weekdays. One hot plate with the buffet is actually really pretty good, good value. Price. Can we start eating? Yes. I want to try the mi sua first. Oh wow, I like it. A lot of coriander. It's not like too watery. Okay, should we try the sides first? No, this one is really good. I like tofu. What does the sauce taste like? Not sure, but... Not sure. Probably with soy sauce, sesame oil, and scallions. Right, right. Okay, okay. Let's I'm try, try the one. scallion pancake. Mm -hmm. It's nice. Oh, it's cheese. It has cheese inside. It's the cheese also. Oh wow. So, this is the fried <laughs> chicken. Maybe we could try this one first. This is like the uh, Taiwan fried chicken. You know, fried chicken. Cutlet, but with fried rice. But you've never tried oh, wow. this this hot plate concept in Taiwan. No, I've never tried this right. before. It's actually pretty good. It's not like the typical ones that you see right. because the sauce looks a bit redder. Go on, I'll go for a stick. Okay, okay, yes, all right. The black pepper taste is definitely there. It's very tender. Like it a, is quite tender. Yeah, very like casual fast food vibe. Like a good meal after school or mm. like a quick lunch date. But so actually, yeah, not nice bad too. because the charred egg taste, not like it kind of gives it a smoky taste. All right. It's a good palate cleanser, the smoke tea. Yeah, I keep like eating this and then like eating mm. milk tea. It kind of works. Mm. Wonder how well mm. we are doing. Any hints? On are we count? even saying our words? Are we? Oh, we are. We? Oh shit, must be very like. Are we in like. Oh box? shit, did I hit this shit? Okay. She's doing Ooh. better. Oh. Competition. This is a competition. This one, so we pick the udon. Oh, hey, the Lord. udon's really soft. Personally, I prefer the fried chicken and the beef because I'm not really like a seafood like kind of person. Feeling. But the tomato sauce is not bad. Okay. Okay. I'm not a fan of like tomatoes. Oh, you just don't like tomato in general. Oh, the udon's good though. I would actually do like steak with udon. Fried steak for fried rice and also not bad. Oh yeah, the fried rice is not bad. Fried rice is really good. Yeah, fried rice is really good. Bumpy is squeaky though. I'm gonna get more. You want more bubble tea? Okay, bye, Seth. We got these cute little takeaway cups for the bubble tea. You can get one of these for $5.90. Right. Unlimited toppings, just as like what we did earlier. Can you I just really... do like all pearls? That's diabetes. As someone who's in uh -huh. marketing, like I love the branding and the colors and like the logo and everything. Okay, okay. There you have it. This is Wong Fu Fu. We're gonna move off to the next spot. Ching. I was actually on a shoot at the beginning of this year. Is the show out yet? Will not show come out, out until later this year. Right. If it does come out, there might be a scene where I puke, puke on, on camera. camera. Is it Netflix? Do you puke on Netflix? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> it's not just puke, it's actually projectile vomit. So, what? you know how I Why? love to projectile vomit, guys? I projectile puke into someone in front Ooh. of me. <laughs> Our third place of the day is Liang Zai Mala. Liang Zai. Which is based off the oh. owner's son. The unique thing about this Mala buffet is a two in one buffet, hot pot, and then there is the barbecue. They have lunch promos every Monday to Friday, 11 30 mm -hmm. to 5, like yep. only like 26 bucks or so. And then, like, 28 plus for dinner. For dinner. Which is really good price. Yeah. Alright, let's go. Next buffet spot. Bye bye. So with the lunch buffet or dinner buffet, you also get the free flow drinks. Free flow drinks? More meat. So Belly beef. Belly beef. Belly. Yeah. And this is pork collar. Okay. So this uh this hole, uh, just let us know if you want more, then we will. Uh, part of the buffet also yeah, lah. So when people order the buffet, you will automatically serve this yes. already lah. Yes. Yeah, I love fat beef. Yeah, cause you. Okay, wow. There's a lot going on yes, here today. We have a lot. So they have six soup bases for their hot pot. Mm -hmm. We chose two of them, which is yep. the pork bone and the mala. Um, they're also famous for Chongqing grilled fish and of course the mala shang guo. Pretty much like you just get a chicken. lot of chicken, you oh, yes, la zi. Zi. You pick, pretty much pick all the ingredients and then you have three ways ish or more than three ways of cooking it, right? Should we try on mala? Oh yes. Mala shang guo that we did. Tofu, uh we chose mild today oh. so that must be weak ass. Oh the the meat is really good. I just tried one of the oh, pork okay. bellies right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh wow. Okay, it's actually quite surprising. Like the, the meats, you know, even though it's like a buffet, it's actually really good. Very um flavorful and then it's also very tender as well. Like they didn't overcook it or anything like that. Okay, let's try the la zi. 
Oh, it's pretty good. And it's still actually like, crispy. It's very crispy. Like and the, it's not like starchy. Like the batter or whatever yeah, they the, use is really, really good. Let's do the fish, I guess. Oh, smells kind of spicy. Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. The, the fish. Oh, the, the fish is actually really fresh. Actually, I'm surprised because there's so many red chilies on this, but the spiciness level is like right. it is mild. It is shala, so it's pretty yeah. good. So, okay, I'm more excited to try the bay I love beef. Would you consider yourself a fei nyo? Bitch, I'm a cow. Bitch, I'm oh wow, this really tastes like a pork bone soup. Oh, <laughs> like they made it like from real. scratch. Oh wow. These are huge cuts of meat. I think this is a good place for like coming with a group of friends. If you come with one friend, the second diner gets like 20% off. If you come with three people, the third person gets 50% off. If you come with four, then they eat for free. They eat for free. Oh shit, I love this place. Oh my god, I'm, I'm all about that meat. It's meat all, tastes really like, fresh. It's really tender. And the flavoring is good as well. The flavors like are good. The yeah, yeah. Okay, so we wrap up? we're gonna move off to the next place. But first, ice cream! Vanilla chocolate and strawberry. Vanilla chocolate, strawberry. Wait, do we get a clue now? Can... Yes, can we finally get, huh? get a clue? Now. Okay. Get a clue. Of one of words. Okay. Oh. oh! Oh! Maybe your word is oh. What the hell? You did. Huh? Wait, what? This is not helpful at all. Two words. And? Oh! It's just like, no way. No way. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, if I say okay, is that oh, oh, oh? That is okay. Okay is a word. It's O. Oh. When I describe a food, I use the N word. <laughs> Whoa, calm down, Jamal. Is it like me? You know, in Chinese, like me, that. Hello, darkness, my old friend. It says second word, that's A. A? Joy, second word, that's double. 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 Have I said it before? Yeah. Oh. Oh, wow. Oh, is it wow? To it prevent does. this, I will not say words with A. Vowels. Or O. The no, third no. word, the third word. The third word, yeah. 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 You have the same last word. Oh! So we're here at. Yum Cha! We're here <laughs> to have our afternoon buffet of dim sum. It's only available from 3 to 6, and it's 32.80 for like unlimited dim sum. Let's Get go. To the AC now. Or buffet. Oh wow. Oh wow. My outfit today inspired by Amy Lau from Beef. What the f <gasps> We ordered a whole bunch of stuff from their popular Not... unique dishes to the typical yeah. like simai. So this one is um, on the a la carte menu, but yeah. you know, we yes. decided to get it to try. You wanna try that first? He sounds so dead. You wanna try that first? I am. Is... Oh wow. You say you didn't like feet, right? I don't like feet. Love you feet. into feet? I am very into feet. All sorts of feet. You're not police! Ooh, sour. But I'm not a fan of vinegar though. <laughs> it's very sour. Usually I'm not like a braised kind of person, but the consistency is pretty light, so it's not super right. heavy. The meat falls off the bone really nicely. Alright, but we're here for dim sum. Uh, xiao long bao, xiao long bao. Let's go xiao long bao. Ooh. Okay. Like the typical xiao long bao with the soup inside. It's not bad, considering it's like you can get this free flow. I think it's a decent xiao long bao. Next item, siu mai with some fish roll. This is a pretty big siu mai. Okay, you know what, let's just split them up. They're mushroom like, bun. No, it's truffle bao. mushroom. Truffle, truffle. No. It feels like there's something inside. Stop so. touching it! I'm not gonna share this with you if you keep touching the bun like that. Ooh. I like how they made the top look like it's truffle. It looks like a mushroom. But that's what truffle looks like as well. You feel a char siu, but... Not bad, not bad. Oh my god, am I saying my words? Is what's it? What's he writing down yes, over there? Yes, what's he writing? What's it? How is it again? It's okay. Me no say words with circle. It's good. Is it? I'm just very full right now, so I can't talk. Oh no! no to, what? That's the F word! A shoulder dislocation is usually a very painful injury. Okay, and this is another recommendation. Mango it just and doesn't prawn stop coming. dumpling. This is a very interesting mix. It's very strange, but... This is very, this is pretty good. It's a really interesting Found combination. Like. A sip of soup. I still love you! 
This feels like the most underwhelming dish so far. Super man. I think if it was hotter, then it would have tasted better. And for the finale. This better be good because like it's hard to find like good mango oh, puddings yeah. in dim sum places nowadays. That is an interesting strategy. Okay. It's very good. It's very soft and silky. It's more custard mm -hmm. than pudding. A creamy like custard. That feels good, yeah. And just like little bits of mango, mango inside. Okay, are we gonna wrap up? Are you full? Oh! No! What was your favorite? I think the mushroom bao was the most innovative. Okay. I think overall, like the taste is quite, you know, standard yum cha, but it's like good dim sum. Above average, though. Yeah, it's definitely above average. My favorite would be the mango fritter. It's very crispy, but the inside, you still get that soft, like prawn and mango texture. This is it for yum cha buffet. Let us wrap up our buffet episode. Umai. Oh, the Forbidden Word Challenge is a landslide with joy. The joy won. The words for joy were full. Full? Wow. Wow. And wow. not bad. Oh, not it was bad not bad is not one word. Not bad is two words. Not bad is two words. Okay, and then the words for there were full, actually, and okay. I knew oh it God. was okay. No, but actually, you say actually, I, actually a lot. I say okay a lot as well. That's why yeah. they picked these words for you. Wait, wait, what's the penalty? So, so which was the most delicious buffet? The one I preferred the most was probably the mala. I felt like that was the most like bang for my butt. The value for money, you know, the surprise, <laughs> the really the broadcast one. And that's it for this episode. Please remember to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank, thank you. See you guys later. Bye. That's right, the bananas on the table is... Is that part of buffet or can eat one or... How does that work, the bananas? Can eat, right? Is it just... <laughs>